Okay, today we're going to talk about a little bit about a great old-fashioned inking technique uh, that a lot of the classic cartoonists used, uh, like Hubert, uh, Woody, Romita, all those guys, Williamson. Uh, and that was to take a razor blade and to drag it across the ink drawing to give you uh, an extra texture. Frank Robbins used to use it. It was a very common technique that was used by the uh, comic strip artists that later on the comic book artists adapted. And it's a great way to add texture to an explosion or rain or all kinds of effects. Uh, Al Williamson even used to use this to uh, chip out, like nick out the stars instead of using um, whiteout. A lot of the uh, Older cartoonists really didn't like using whiteout on their pages, so they would take the uh, the razor blade and they would sc scratch away uh, at uh, whatever little blemishes or little mistakes that they would make. So you can usually find these at any hardware store or art supply store. Uh, they usually come sometimes a hundred to a pack. Um, they're usually pretty cheap and they come wrapped with cardboard. So the main thing you have to do is have a very sharp one because a dull one will tear the paper and will not skim across the surface. So you're going to hold it and get it at an angle so it's sort of slightly facing in towards your body at say about a 30 or 45 degree angle and then you pull the razor blade towards you and it will skip across the paper um, and as it skips across the paper it will dig out little divots and will give you a really cool effect. You want to make sure, of course, your blade is very sharp. Because a dull blade will not skip. It'll tear into the paper. So as you can see, you can really get a lot of cool effects. <laughs> 